Welcome to RK Tutorials. Solutions to Engineering Mechanics Textbook, 5th edition by S. Timoshenko, D. H. Eng, J. V. Rao and Sukumar Patil. In this video, we will solve the problem set 2.1 and problem number 2.7. Draw the free body diagram of the bars AC and BC shown in the figure. Our interest is to find only the free body diagrams of AC and BC. Now in this problem, AC and BC are connected at C. And a horizontal force of 4450 newtons acting at C. A it is fixed, at A it is fixed and at B also it is fixed. Some various dimensions are given. The formulas or concepts required to solve the problem is, if any system contains the string or cable or ropes etc. The force is along the axis and it is away from the support. Similarly, if the system contains any bars or struts or booms, the force is along the axis and the direction will be decided whether it is a tension or compression is based on its equilibrium condition. Similarly, if any body is supported with wall or floor or trough etc., there is a reaction force developed on the body. And that reaction force is always perpendicular to the support and it is towards the body. Okay, so with this concept, let us go to the solution of our problem. Now, since C force, since at C, a force of 4450 newtons are acting towards the horizontal direction, we can observe that the string AC is in tension and the bar CB is in compression. Since it is pulling in this direction, the bar AC will get elongated, the bar CB may get compressed. Hence, the force that acting at AC is in tensile, let the magnitude is S1, and the force acting at CB is compressive, and that magnitude is S2. S2, clearly we can see it is compression. S1, clearly we can see it is tensile. So these two are the free body diagrams of AC and C. We would also like to extend this problem by drawing the free body diagram at C. I would like to draw the free body diagram at C. What are the various forces acting at C? You can see here at C the force is 4450, one force is acting. Another force is the force in the string AC, in the bar AC and another force is the force in the bar CB. But here the magnitudes and the directions are also important. First let us calculate the angles made by the bars AC and CB. Let the angle made by bar AC with the horizontal is alpha and the angle made by CB with the horizontal is beta. Now from the right angle triangle AC, uh, let us put a name here D. So from the a triangle ACD, this angle is 90 degrees. So from the right angle triangle ACD, 
So tan alpha is equal to 762 by 915, which is 0.832, or alpha is equal to 39.79. Similarly, from the right angle triangle CBD, right angle triangle CBD, tan beta is equal to 762 by 610, opposite side by adjacent side, which is 1.249, and beta value is equal to 51.32 degrees. Let us draw the various forces acting at C. So this is my C and I am drawing my X and Y axis. Now tell me what are the various forces. Of course, the first force is 4450 acts towards right side. This is the first force 4450 acts towards right side. The next one is the force in the AC. As far as AC is concerned, the force is a tensile and it is away from C magnitude is S1. But the same force, if you look at from point C, it is away from C and the magnitude is S1. Similarly, if you look at that bar CB, the force is towards C and the force is towards C and the magnitude is S2. It is exactly opposite direction. So if this is upwards, the from point C, the force is like this. And from point C, the force is like this. Okay. So this value is S2. And the angle made by the horizontal with S1, of course, this angle is alpha. We calculated that value is 39.79. And angle made by S2 with the horizontal is 51.32 degrees. My dear friends and students, if you want the solution for any of the subject in the field of machine design, namely strength of materials, theory of machines, machine design, engineering mechanics, finite element method, mechanical vibrations, Please give the reference in the comment section so that I will solve the problem, prepare a video and upload in my channel. Please subscribe and share my video.